On August 13, a high-spirited Chris Brown gave Billboard his first formal interview since leaving jail in June. Kicked back in front of a control board at Hollywood's Hot Chalice Recording Studios, a vintage gear stuffed space favored by young artists, the 25-year-old was taking a late afternoon break from putting the finishing touches on his sixth studio album, X. But like much of his recent life, the day featured a major distraction from the music. Hours earlier, the singer, who lives in Los Angeles, had to appear in a courtroom to get a positive progress report on sticking to his probation. That five-year probation stems from Brown's 2009 conviction for assaulting ex-girlfriend Rahanna, an attack that remains notorious despite his public apologies, trips to rehab for anger management and diagnoses with both bipolar and post-traumatic stress disorders. Brown's sometimes belligerent attitude and other tangles with the law haven't helped. The 108 days he spent in a Los Angeles County jail this year were for violating parole after assaulting a stranger outside a Washington, D.C., hotel in October 2013. Brown, who pled guilty to that charge on September 2 and was sentenced to time served, punched the victim after the man tried to get into a photo with him. He also has allegedly brawled with Drake and Frank Ocean.